that was it. No, uh, that would be awful. Uh, guys, um, Evelyn has a lot of body image issues, uh, which makes sense, because she hasn't seen her reflection in hundreds of years. <laughs> so, uh, so, uh, Uh, Ashley looks like she emerged straight from the dust bowl. <laughs> Every time I see a picture of her, I mistake it for something taken by Dorothea Lange. Oh. Thank you, Wednesday Saddams. Uh, <laughs> no, um, Evelyn is the porcelain doll that moves in the night when you're not looking. <laughs> you know? Yeah, she doesn't giggle. You just hear her saying, <sighs> Really? <laughs> Thank you, Grapes of Rashley. Uh, <laughs> um, Ashley used to work at Victoria's Secret, which really destroyed her body image. Because every day she would have to use a measuring tape. And you can wrap that pretty tight, but it can still only suspend so much weight. <laughs> You can try, you know, no? If you put two of them together, uh, it has more weight. Uh, <laughs> no, uh, Evelyn, she has a lot of piercings, um, mostly because her doctor said she needed more iron. Yeah. The lip ring she has uh, is the closest thing she'll ever get to eating. So. Yeah, yeah, Ashley, and you're the Olsen twin who just has Lyme disease. Uh, Ashley is like a dead tooth. Uh, most conversations would go better if she just wasn't there at all. You and me both. <laughs> no, um, Evelyn doesn't watch television. Yeah, she just crawls out of them. <laughs> yeah. Your electricity isn't acting funny, she just needs more attention. <laughs> uh, Ashley's lips are actually two leeches. Uh, from when they were trying to rid her of hysteria. <laughs> Thank you, Sarah Slenderman. Uh, <laughs> Evelyn has the face of an orphan who was 35 the whole time. Uh, yeah, she's not a 90s baby. That's just when they, the archaeologists excavated her. Uh, yeah, it's wild. Ashley has a minor in criminology. Yeah, she, uh, she tried to go into forensics, and then the coroner was like, ah, how did you open the drawer from the inside? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, this is crazy, because Evelyn has actually lived with depression for so long. Um, it's true. Her period and wrists have synced up. Guys, if her wrists could talk, uh, she'd be arrested. <laughs> so. uh, I, I like being around Ashley, but I'm always afraid I'm gonna contract some Victorian era disease. <laughs> I got it. Thank you. That was it. Yeah. <laughs> I appreciate it. Last joke. As a compliment. Um, Evelyn, uh, from her eating disorder, has osteoporosis. I know, which prevents her from uh, bending and twisting, unless it's the truth about, <laughs> yeah, about who the real Evelyn Troutman is. <laughs> I don't know 
what that means, but I liked it. I, no, yeah, Ashley's sympathetic to the osteoporosis because she has rickets. Um, I, uh, Ashley reminds me a little bit of the Little Mermaid. All she wants in life is a thigh gap. <laughs> Give it up for that, everybody. Wow. Great job. Those are, man, those are just awesome, creative, hilarious jokes, man. I want to I wanna get first thoughts from Adam Quazzo. Now that was a fucking battle. Uh, also, look, I'm having trouble. I don't know if I should vote for the shy suicidal one. Or the suicidal shy one. Uh, yeah, this is just girl interrupted. Like, I want to just vote for the concept of digesting your food, but then neither of them win. Uh, I, uh, ooh, I love what Evelyn did with that Victorian character and kept it going all the way through and surprised that y'all went on that journey with her. Uh, but I think Ashley just had like that one extra just, like we're talking like the weight of a feather is the difference here. I, that, w that wasn't supposed to be a dig. I'm saying it was that fucking close. Just by a goddamn hair, I'm gonna go Ashley on this. Okay, Ashley gets a vote. We'll see, John. Hey, Crit, next time, can I sit on the other side of him? <laughs> For the love, I got really not a lot to say. I thought... I, <sighs> he already said all the stuff we could think. <laughs> you know? No, I, I, I love this. This was my favorite one so far, for sure. I just thought Ashley hit them all, and... For the first time ever, I saw Evelyn miss one. So I'm going to go with Ashley. Ashley gets two votes. Give it up for Ashley. <laughs> Leah. Um, I love both of these battlers. That was a great battle. Um, I, I agree that it was really close. I don't even have any mean shit to say to y'all. <laughs> um, I think that, well, first of all, Ashley, I like whatever you did with that twist, the truth, Joe. I love that you did that for you only. <laughs> Um, but I just think you just had like a slight edge over Evelyn on this one, and I love you both, and great job. Ashley wins the battle. Give it up for Ashley Lusk. Ooh, Ashley. Wow. Hell yeah. That was fantastic. Allie. Um, I wrote down either of them wash their hair, question mark. <laughs> Um, but this was this coming from someone who closed with an anorexic joke. This, you know, it, it was up my alley. I loved it. It was so, <laughs> it was such a close battle for me. But the TV joke, Ashley, was so good. I have to give it to Ashley. Awesome, Ashley, with one. And then final thoughts from Aaron. Uh, I liked it. It was good. <laughs> yeah, both of you had a really good uh, comebacks. And uh, Evelyn, you had a reference to Dorothy Elaine. Who is that? Uh, she, like, was one of the main photographers during the Dust Bowl. <laughs> you know that, like, sad woman with the child who's, like, burying the face and the shoulder? No. Okay, well, it's from <laughs> AP U.S. History. I don't know. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Now we know. Now we all know. So that's nice. Isn't that nice? Yeah, uh, yeah I'll give it to Ashley. She did very well. Both wow. Times. Ashley wins it. But one more time for this battle. Both of them are amazing. Oh, man. 